Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Like you guys requested, I am going to do um, my current designer shoes collection video. And I'm going to do each one and tell you what is positive and also negative about the one. I'm like looking through everything <laughs> down right here. It was uh, quite a job to move everything here. And I am going to tell you guys what's my most used and favorite. Yeah, starting that and go through and at the end, it will be more like least used and I don't recommend type thing. Oh, let's so. begin with the spring and summer shoes that I favor the most and use the most first, shall we? So I picked these as my most worn and favorite of mine for spring and summer both neutral color, both I went with true to size and both from Valentino's. I didn't know how much I love Valentino's, but anyways, I love these. Give you what, two to three inches. So make you look taller and actually elongate your legs. Also, when you're just in the front, every time I wear these, I look so much better, more stylish, more put together, just, very comfortable. Just cannot say enough about them. These are absolute favorite. I got these last year or the year before. I don't remember, but I wore them so much. I'm like very embarrassed to show you guys how dirty these are. Very, very comfortable. Just love them. And one thing that I would say uh, negative Maybe the leather not as hard wearing as of course these. These are plastic kind of rubbery, so cannot go wrong and super durable I find. But the leather, uh, I see some scratches on the front here, but how much I wore, of course, I cannot really say that anyways. Yeah, I wear these everywhere. They have flat version of these and taller ones and have the, you know, like strap going up or down. I mean, they have so many different styles, but these I love. I know I don't have other pairs, but I already know right away, these are the ones that I will repurchase if I have to because super easy to get in. I may call it lazy, but I just personally, I love easy shoes that I can just, you know, slide in and walk out the door. That's what I like. So these are easy to wear, but still looking fabulous. Whenever you guys ask me which color to go with, because they have so many colors, you just, they have red, pink, powdery pink, and I mean, they have gold and silver. I have silver right here. So whenever you ask me, I say go with black because it pops against your skin and it's really pretty. Black just cannot go wrong. And I mean, on the bottom, you can see it's black so you cannot even tell. Yeah. Anyways, these two I wear the most and nude, I wear a lot. Like I wear a lot of white jeans. They look really good together. I don't really have any negative thing about these flip-flops. They are very comfortable, super cute on and adorable. I see myself getting maybe a pop of color. These look really cute with dresses and shorts and even long jeans skirts, whatever you call, these look very, very cute. Next most used and loved are these orange sandals, especially white. I also have gold right here, but against my skin tone, I guess, white pops more than gold. Gold kind of blends in and mm, yeah, still pretty, but I go with white a lot, especially when I wear white jeans look really really nice on so yeah but you can find the dupe for the same look with a lot less so i'll have the link to them down below and you can see on the bottom so dirty but these have been holding up actually a lot better than i thought because I wore them so much. And these are my recent favorite. I've been really loving. They look amazing, looking so cute. And uh, mules. 
these have nothing on the back so great to wear spring and summer so very very pretty and it's got the pop of color just tiny bit still neutral i find them very comfy so highly recommend for you guys to try these out they also have black as well these run pretty large so i recommend you to try them on or go half size down i love chanel bags but also their shoes i'm a big fan and these are the slides i got last year and it's very very pretty little stones in different color with the cc the silver hardware very very nice and yeah it's kind of like espadrille looking slides comfortable but not like super comfortable i would say maybe because of this hardware every time i walk i kind of feel that it's a little restricting you know so but yeah i don't really have regrets from getting these when these were released sold out pretty fast and they also have red i believe and ivory or white white looked really really nice another chanel slice tweed on the front with the cc little charm here very cute but these are different style like more tomboy-ish very chic and these make your feet bigger and wider so not as feminine like normally i go with but different and yeah very very chic and i don't think these are that comfortable for me but my friend robin she told me these are very comfortable because she has narrow feet so if you have wide feet i don't think these are gonna be for you i have somewhat in between so still fine but every time i walk in these i don't i don't know i want to change out to another shoe that's how i feel but not as bad yes i've seen these with olive green color and black and red i've seen many different i wear 37 true to size pretty much everything from chanel and other brands so that size normally go really fast but these were on sale and 37 so i was like so happy when i got these and i am still happy that i got them um somewhat neutral not too bright but still pop of color i don't know if you know what i'm talking about but i love the color i have nothing like this somewhat curly pinky nude yeah very pretty and little details right down here diamond stitching going on everywhere and the hardware is almost like rose gold to me it's like a light gold shade so yeah very pretty i love very comfortable also these are my last chanel slides very feminine and narrow fit looking guess what i never wore these outside i wore once i think inside of the house and i changed to something else and yeah went outside i don't know i just think that these look really delicate and looks like you need to wear them at home and i didn't really have to get them honestly but these were on sale so just like those yeah i got both of them at the same time and amelia flower on the front and little details with the patent leather in this area with the little pearl in the middle i find them very very flattering and cute and it's got a little tiny cc right here yeah very cute something like these you can wait and buy when they are on sale yeah. these are pretty new so least used ones but i wanted to just show you guys now as i'm talking about spring and summer shoes these are from hermes looking like orange sandal right on the front but these got heels right here not too high so still comfortable but every time you walk you can feel like click 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 and <laughs> make sound but i have never worn outside so very clean i got these right before last fall so i didn't have a chance to wear these but cannot wait to wear them 
this summer. These will look great with my little Lady Dior and also a Chanel Classic Flap Light Gold. These are from Hermes and called Legend. And I got the color black. And it's got heels there, like three inches, not too tall, so very comfortable. But I haven't really walked in these for long time or I haven't worn outside, you can see. So cannot say much about that, but looking very, very fabulous and just love classic look. Let's talk about Manolo Blani. <laughs> like, I've been really into these. Oh my goodness. I'm like, I don't know how to show. I don't want to touch the bottom. It's got 30, as you can see. These are 70 millimeters, so somewhat uh, tall, but not like flat like these. These are very comfy. The flat ones, these are dark gray color. And it's so blingy. Very, very, very beautiful. These I went size up, so half size up. Those are classy looking. I don't have any regrets paying that much for the flats. I wear flats a lot, but now my kids are a little bit uh, bigger, <laughs> I'll say. So I started to wear heels like this one. Oh my goodness. These are very comfortable. I will say if you don't have to get this 105 millimeter, I highly recommend you to go with 70 millimeter. I don't know, it's so hard to hold on to these. But anyways, these are of course black and these are like Mm, nude blush pink color super wearable prettier than nude color in my opinion but very neutral and i just wish i got the 70 millimeter instead of 105 these are very very uncomfortable yes very uncomfortable unless you want to go with really high like 105 I recommend going with 70 millimeter. These look very nice, super classy, really elegant, very comfortable. Cannot say enough about them. Both I went with true to size. I get asked a lot if these wear well because it's not leather, it's not patent, it's not plastic. So yeah, it's satin, wear well and looks really nice. And I love the crystals. Oh yes, they bling right amount, not too much. I don't like like crazy, but yeah, these look very classy. Highly recommend 70 millimeter. Yeah, if you want comfort yet stylish and looking more tall. Yeah. And the ones that I share in this video, I'll have link to them down below if they're available online. And these, of course, I have to share my Valentino Rockstar flats. Oh yes, I've had these for years now and still love them. I know I haven't worn these a whole lot like I used to, but still looking fabulous and fantastic. And I recommend you to go with different sites where you can get them on sale. Yeah, when I got these, they were very, very popular and was really hard to get. For pointy toe flats, I normally go half size up and these, of course, I went half size up and they look very, very nice on. And I love these flats and I don't like the ones with the strap on, which you see right here, these, I don't really wear much, like I said earlier. I find them kind of hard to get on and off and I don't know, I like something easy and fast. So that's just my own uh, personal issue, I guess I have, but yeah, nonetheless, they look fantastic and very nice. The nude and black flats without these are patent leather, so they stretch out faster or more than these just leather. So I find these uncomfortable. Yeah. Okay, these are my only Christian Louboutins I own. Yeah, these are Cornell. Is that how you call it? It's 100 or 105, I believe. Very tall, but I find these 
look very sexy and still comfortable enough for you to walk and like compared to other like so kate i could not walk at all but looking very very good i used to wear these whenever i have date night with wearing dress but after getting manolo those blush color i stopped wearing these and yeah i love those so much so i haven't worn these that much lately but i still love and very classy let's talk about aspidrols oh my goodness these are my most worn for sure for sure more than chanel aspidrols you're gonna see these i wore so much and these are the first i got so i went with navy afterwards so these i wore more and you can kind of see on the bottom how much i wore but they wear so well oh my goodness i wore this like to death like everywhere but i don't see any like like serious wear and tear are not even just serious it looks really good really good yes very classy look and lightweight and it's not as thick as my chanel aspidrols and um, easier to walk in because it does not have much weight so love 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 now they have newer styles so i'll have a link to the newer one that's got a little leather trim here and there i think they are very very adorable uh, these are my chanel aspidrols and i got the black one first these are with the lambskin so very very soft and it molds into the shape of your feet so very comfy but like i said earlier for burberry these have thicker sole and heavier so i find the Burberry ones more comfy and easier to walk for hours these are comfortable but when I walk all day I start to feel like uh, oh, so these heavy. were second pair I got after I loved black one and both I got true to size 37 and I don't really like that this thing happen after wearing sometimes like that always come out and that one also little thingy came out i don't know if you can see it it just comes like that so yeah burberry ones never do that i mean i only have two but these like these that these are the third pair but you can see the dust over because i haven't really worn and these are limited edition yes you know aspidrols i find these more tight fit than lambskin because lambskin you know tends to stretch out these are linen so not as comfy but still comfortable these are espadrilles so i love the color just got many different colors it's got the patent leather front here and the cc so very special it's got silver leather and the tweed so it's actually very comfortable and very flexible I know when I like something, I repeat. And these are another Chanel Aspidrols, navy and the pink. And these were canvas. So, yeah, true to size, same thing. I promise. These are the last. <laughs> Black suede leather with the pearl, very, very adorable. And these are canvas, gray color. It's like light gray color. I find myself wearing these a lot with white jeans and blue jeans. These look really good during spring and summer. I bought these last year, and since then, I've been non stop wearing. Seriously, I love the color. Neutral, I find. Blush pink, my favorite. And super comfy. And it makes you look taller than wearing flats but still feels like you're wearing flats because very very comfortable i love gucci marmont line so of course i love and these wear really well i wore them so much but i have no issue on the suede leather i even bought the spray to protect the suede but i didn't even use it and still looking fabulous yeah 
I don't see any wear and tear at all. Chanel Balena flats. I used to wear a whole lot. I haven't worn these that much after I started to love pointy toe shoes. So yeah, but very classy and elegant, ladylike shoes. These I highly recommend if you're thinking of getting one from Chanel. Just cannot go wrong with this nude color with the black cap toe. Very, very classy. These are true red patent leather cap toe with the leather right here. Super comfortable. True to size. These are special because it's got the classic diamond shape quilting there and pink, of course, I love. Very comfortable. And you guys know I am Louis Vuitton fan, a big fan for like, you know, SLGs and the bags, but the shoes, I don't know, for some reason, I don't really find the one that I wear so much. Maybe I should have gone with slides or so, but I talked about these as like ugh, least or like somewhat regret purchase. I just, yeah, after trying to wear, I find these super heavy and my feet just come out every time I try to walk in these because it's got the little uh, heel inside that you cannot take off like this much. When you have them on, looks really good just start to walk uh, my foot just comes out so that's just the issue i have but i love the color of course the blush pink and the red accent on the back and the gold details absolutely love but like i said very heavy it's like going down i mean i wish they just didn't Put this little thingy to make you look taller i mean looks better i guess but just yeah and these i wear more than anything from louis vuitton um so sneakers so these are very comfortable i find and mine i got with the rose gold so very pretty but I tend to wear slides for spring and summer and fall and winter, aspidrules, I guess. So maybe I should have not gotten these. But when I saw these, I fell in love. And my essay, Julini, she was kept talking about these. So I was like, okay, I will get one and try and see. But I haven't really worn that much, to be honest. Um, but I still love and I love the Louis Vuitton canvas there. That's very nice. And these are like the ones I had for a really long time. I don't know how many years, maybe five years. I don't even remember, but the hardware did not get tarnished. It's still looking great. It's still shiny and gold right here. And it's supposed to look like this and um, it's just stretched out when you wear them but very very tight fit uh i went a whole size up but still and but little details it's really nice nice touch and it's supposed to look like worn finish or suede looking it's leather so. prada driving shoes very comfortable and very lovely to wear i will be wearing more during spring and summer because it's white so yeah very comfy these are my burberry flats that i find very comfortable looking very classy i love the white more than the navy but I got these first, I believe, and then I went with the navy also as I love these so much. Burberry shoes wear really well and less pricey than other ones that I showed you guys. My Ferragamo shoes. These are the flats I love. I used to wear these a lot, you can see. But like I said, I started to love pointy shoes. So I went with Valentino and now Manolo. So yeah, haven't worn that much, but still love and very classy shape as well. 
I hope I didn't miss any. Uh, if I did, I will say something or if I can find the links to them, I will leave all down below in the description box. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you enjoyed, please give this video a thumbs up and I shall see you guys very soon. Bye guys!